As we look at the landscape of education today, we realize that it's changing. So we were very intentional about the work for college and career readiness. This campus models the opportunity for students that are preparing for both worlds. So whether you're gonna go straight into the workforce, whether you're going to go to college, this campus is designed to be supportive I think Canyon View really represents an incredible precedence and benchmark for the country. It celebrates the individuality of each student, but without sacrificing any of the rigor that's really required for a high school education today. We've got a ton of diversity here at Canyon View High School. It's an interesting dichotomy between all of our students on campus, what they do, what they're involved in. We don't have any closed spaces. I tell our teachers all the time, if you're coming to a school where you can go into your classroom, close the door, teach for eight hours, and then leave, that's not gonna happen here. Our students and our teachers interact with each other so much because of the structure of the forts and the structure of the agora and the open spaces. You're gonna be around different people and you're gonna engage with them. These forts are designed on a grid. This efficiency allows us to create the agile spaces, the different scales. It was really an opportunity to leverage space in a different way. Think about when you were a young child playing with your neighbors or your family. You wanted to build a fort. You grabbed some blankets, you grabbed some, some couch cushions and some pillows, and you made something in that moment. That's what we wanted this place to be. We wanted to be something in the moment. I think like all the different classrooms, like that's so cool because it's not just the same classroom five different times, like all the hours of the day. If you think about this project and you think about the infusion of technology, if you think about the learning spaces and the research that went into that, if you really begin to think about the depth of how this is sustainable into the future, you begin to understand that this project is unique and it's innovative and it really is something that's going to change the way that we teach. We are a STEM focused school so um, we try to really integrate the engineering design process through all of our instruction and so our, our teachers have really grabbed a hold of that. They've grabbed a hold of the building and the flexible ways that they can deliver instruction. They've been amazing in just finding different ways to really deliver the information to the students in a non-traditional format. in the traditional classroom setting for the last eight years and coming to Canyon View I was a little nervous I will admit uh, because I knew that I would have to give up that that power of being able to go into a classroom and close my door this is a student center environment and that's what I wanted as a teacher it's an environment of gratitude and when you work in an environment like that you feel happy to come to work I wake up happy to come to work Throughout the course of the design as we were working through the scope of the project, we were challenged collectively as a team to keep raising the bar. We're super proud of the product that's been produced. This is a tremendous value to the community. Environmental stewardship has been a priority for the district for well over a decade. And the district was not interested in having a plaque on the wall. They were interested in finding something that is customized to their priorities and their values. Leveraging this unique climate to new levels, we were tasked with creating space outside that could be leveraged for education. The Agora is really simply the tie that binds, and it works because of high performance design. We spend a lot of time coming up with a building that we think is super cool to look at, but it's also comfortable and it's functional and the energy savings works for us and allows us to put more money into the teaching and learning. This process was about planning for a vision. That vision became architecture and now transcends a simple collection of spaces. This place is Canyon View High School. The one thing I'm confident about, this is the future of education.